my name is Helen Lodge, and when I thought about uh, entering, what drew me to the Retiro, it was a cloister at that time, very strict, but I was looking for something different. There was something in me that was uh, looking for a deeper relationship with God. And the cloister looked like that was where God was leading me. And so I entered in 1961. And I stayed for five years. At that time, it was very strict. Uh, we ate meat like four times a year. And uh, I went out twice uh, to go to the eye doctor. You know, the dentist came in. You didn't have to worry about all the other things, you know. Uh, but you didn't go home for vacation. You know, it was quite strict, but it was not a strict silence. There was, what would you say, there was an atmosphere of God in the silence. So it was never a heavy silence. So I stayed for five years. I left in August of 1966. In October of 66, I was appointed the director of Juniors, the Formation Sisters. And from, uh, but the, I would say the background that I received, you know, in the Retiro, in the cloister, uh, was so helpful, not only in that ministry, but in everything that I did following that. Uh, I, I think the years ahead were impacted by my time that I spent praying and finding God in a di different way, a deeper way, you know, in the material. Uh, and I would say, you know, the need to take time for prayer, to listen, to see things differently, and to find God in all parts of my life, I think started with my time in the material, having time to think, to listen, and let God speak to me.